Hello everyone, welcome back. I'm very excited to be bringing you my Christmas gift guide today. So hopefully you haven't all already done all your Christmas shopping or if you have, you might wanna add a few extra things to your Christmas list. Everything I've chosen in this gift guide comes from small businesses or independent creators or artists based in the UK. And most of the products, if not all of the products are inspired by the nature or surroundings in which that person or that business is based. So I'm really excited to share all these items with you that go all the way from Cornwall up to North Uist in Scotland, from Wales to Dartmoor and all over the country. Everything will be linked down below as well and I hope you like it. First up we are heading to Wales and I've chosen this beautiful throw from a company called Melon Trigwint who are a family run business based on the Pembrokeshire coast in Wales. They weave all of their products in their small mill and everything is made from 100% pure wool. I've opted for this vintage star pattern in the gorse colour but they have so many beautiful designs. This is a little bit more of a pricey gift, it's £179 so some Something a little bit special for someone who wants to cozy up with a beautiful throw all year round. Next up I have chosen this beautiful little coffee cup made by George Bronwyn who's based in the Quantock Hills in Somerset. He hand makes all of his pottery in a beautiful studio down there and he has so many amazing designs. I think handmade pottery is such a lovely gift especially something like a coffee cup because the person will probably end up using it almost every day so every time they see it and use it they'll think of that gift that you bought them. George's mugs cost around 20 to 30 pounds and you can drop him a DM on Instagram if you want to order one. For someone who wants to get out winter walking next year, a merino is a really good place to start. This is a long sleeve merino from Isobar who are based down in London. All of their merino is ethically sourced and it also comes in recyclable packaging which is amazing to see. This costs £75 so it's a little bit more pricey again but for someone who wants to get out walking in the winter in the colder months it's really an essential item so it would make such a nice gift. Next up I've chosen the lovely little Explore set from Land & Water. Land & Water are a Cornwall based bath and body company who are inspired by both land and sea. All of their products are vegan, not tested on animals and the bottles are made from recyclable packaging as well. I think this little Explore set would make an amazing gift for someone who wants to get on some weekends away next year when we are able to or even something that you can put in your van if you're planning some van trips. It's got a little shampoo, conditioner, body lotion, body wash and an alcohol hand gel as well. So it's got pretty much every base covered. Their scents are so beautiful as well and the products just feel really, really nourishing. It's like a little touch of natural luxury. This costs £35. Ellis O'Connor is an artist whose work I have admired for years. She's based up in North Uist and her art is inspired by the wild and rugged Scottish landscapes. I only realised recently that she did print so I picked up this absolutely beautiful print by her which cost £75 and I think would make a beautiful gift for someone who loves the ocean and who loves the wild Scottish landscapes and sea. Pretty much every time I go out for a walk I wear this headband and I get asked so many questions about it. It is handmade by a girl called Jen who lives in Ireland. It's also fleece lined so it keeps your ears super warm. This would make such a great gift for someone again who wants to get out on some more winter walks. I actually wear this pretty much all year round. It costs £15 and Jen sells these on Etsy. Another thing you guys will have seen me using pretty much every time I go out in the hills is outdoor provisions bars. They are my fuel, they are so tasty, delicious, vegan, sustainable and made from compostable packaging as well. They do these great mixed boxes. I actually first came across the brand when I bought Harvey a little mix box last year for Christmas. Outdoor provisions also do subscription and they're doing one with the folk at Blossom Coffee Roasters who are also based up in Manchester 
Manchester where outdoor provisions are based. This is a sustainable coffee company and tastes so good. This is the coffee that we keep in the van all the time and I take out camping and hiking with me pretty much all of the time. Outdoor provisions also very kindly gave me a discount code for you guys which is Oslo 20 and will give you 20% off. That will be linked down below as well. Next up, I've chosen this absolutely beautiful 2021 calendar from an artist and designer called Isla Joy Middleton. I picked this up from a lovely homeware store called Midgley Green, placed down in Clevedon. I really love all her designs and the calendar only costs 14 pounds as well, so isn't super pricey. She also does these really beautiful notebook designs. I recently bought this and I've been taking it into the hills with me every time I go and I just like to write little notes when I'm out and about. This also costs just £12, so another fairly cheap item that's really, really beautiful. Next up, we're heading down to Dartmoor and I've chosen this beautifully designed Rambler's Roll from Moorswood. This one is made from Herdwick Tweed from the Lake District and has this gorgeous leather strap as well. This would be an ideal gift for someone who likes to take things a little slower when they're outside. Their ethos is all about taking time, sitting down on your Rambler's Roll with a cup of tea and enjoying the landscape. This Rambler's Roll costs £73 and they also have a few other designs on their website. For someone who loves climbing, I definitely recommend checking out the Boulder Prints by Sim Warren. All of the prints are from either Font or the Peak District. Sim also does little mini print sets and he's just released a set of Font Trump cards as well. Before I wrap up this Christmas gift guide, I of course wanted to mention my own new walking guidebook to the Peak District. It includes 12 walks as well as over 50 sites of interest, pubs, cafes, accommodation, and is perfect for any of you who want to explore the Peak District a little bit more in 2021. It costs £16 and I think will bring you a lot of joy in discovering new parts of the Peak District in the new year. I really hope you enjoyed this Christmas gift guide and have been inspired to check out some of the small businesses and independent artists and creators who I've mentioned here. It's been a really difficult time this year with the coronavirus pandemic, so I think it's so important to support those small businesses who put so much love, care and attention into everything they produce and create. As I mentioned, everything will be linked down below and let me know if you end up buying anything or getting anything for Christmas. Have a very lovely December and I'll see you very soon.